call to order of the License Hearing and Public Safety Committee, September 28th, 2022. Roll call. Alderperson Bardfeldy, I am here. Betty Ackley is excused. Dean Decker is excused. Joe Heidemann. Here. Amanda Salazar. Here. All right, that's it. Uh, Pledge of Allegiance, stand if you can. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The introduction of committee members, staff, and guests. Uh, Alderperson Joe Heidemann, do you want to start? Uh, Joe Heidemann, 10th District. Chuck Adams, City Attorney. Mike Lubert, Assistant Fire Chief. Eric Montiano, Fire Chief. Kathy Hoffman, City Attorney's Office. Barbara Feldy, I am the Chair of the Committee and um, also the President of the Common Council. Uh, Amanda Salazar, Representative District 3. All right. Approval and, of and minutes Dave. from Pat no, and Dave. No, and Dave. It's Dave. always and Dave. Um, introduction of, no, I'm sorry. Approval of minutes from September 24th, September 14th, 2022. Make a motion to approve. Second. Okay. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed nay. Chair votes aye. Approved. Number six, resolution number 6922-23-919-22, a resolution authorizing the appropriate city officials to execute an agreement with Target Solutions Learning LLC, DBA Vector Solutions, Vector, to implement scheduling software at the Sheboygan Fire Department. Chief, take it away. Thank you, Chair. So um, I brought uh, Assistant Chief Mike Luber with me to explain he, he is oversees our administrative access aspect of the fire department. So this is one of the programs and contracts that he's been working with, with and he can explain what we'll utilize it for and what it's replaced. Um, so currently we use two computer programs. We use one that's called uh, ESO for our daily scheduling of our rosters and our overtime and everything like that. And then we use another program that's called One Call Now. That's what we do of all of our callbacks and if we need overtime or like an emergency callback for a fire. Um, in addition to that right now, we also have a few Excel spreadsheets. So over the last year, I kind of looked at a couple different programs, talked with other departments to see what might better fit our department and be more efficient and user friendly. Um, so um, we came up with Vector Solutions it's a company that we already use for our training program within our department. Um, one of the things it's gonna do is it's gonna take both of these programs and combine them into one. So Vector Solutions will take care of our day-to-day -day scheduling on all of our fire apparatus. Um, so there's a roster built for each shift. And then the battalion chief um, will move people around on the schedule based on who's off for the day or any sick calls or anything like that. And this program helps us because it's geared towards fire departments so we can see like a month or two out to see where we need to do our schedule and our callbacks and things like that um, in addition right now our members have to log on to a computer at home this program also has an app that they can have on their phone so if we move them from one spot to another for the next day they'll get a message on their phone um, also all of our callbacks will go right to their phone now through the app and they can respond back to the on the app saying hey we're coming in or hey i take this overtime um, and things like those um, so the cost for it right now, which is the $6,164, um, that's all in our budget. We didn't need any more money for it. The two programs together were roughly that 6,100. So that's where we came up with the money for it. Um, so Vector Solutions is supplying the software and the hardware. Um, they're going to take care of the training for us. And then it's going to help us with our scheduling and our on-duty callbacks as well. Awesome. Any questions? I asked some questions earlier. Uh, Again, I was concerned about it only said 6,000, but then since they already had the money available because of getting rid of the other two programs, are these companies, are are they started by people that were in the fire business? Sometimes, sometimes they are. This one actually was put together by 
people that work in the fire service. Right. So it's like really very nicely geared towards us and how we operate our apparatus and do our callbacks. And um, like we deal with things like Fair Labor Standards Act pay and stuff like that. So it works very nicely for that. And this is uh, accepted by many of the other departments within the state of Wisconsin or? Yeah, actually I reached out to a few departments. Um, Fond du Lac was using it. They had good luck with it. Um, Kenosha was using it. They really had good luck with it. So I, I did ask around as well and get some references. Thank you. And then, sorry, I mean, no, no. we actually, they did let us trial it for like three months. So we did trial it in house before mm -hmm. we decided to buy it. Well, that's making sure that they know what they're doing if they're letting you mm -hmm. trial it for a couple mm -hmm. months for free. Is there any other questions, comments? No. Okay, I need a motion. Move to approve. Second. Okay. Any, any discussion? Oh, sorry. All in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed nay. Chair votes aye. Motion passes. Thank you for your support. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Next meeting date will be October 12, 2022. Regarding that, um, just so you know, I will not be here on October 12th, and Attorney Majerus is also not available on October 12th. So there will be no attorneys, attorneys staffing the meeting, and it is the budget meeting. Um, so, so I, I, I will be around, so I'm leaving that day. So if you want to meet earlier in the day, but I know that doesn't always no, work for folks, work. um, Monday or Tuesday of that week could potentially work too. But if not, you can also just meet, just know that I won't be there. I don't know. I know. <laughs> not Dean, can tell you what we're doing. I, I know <laughs> Dean has, has, um, DPW on Tuesdays. That's at 530. Oh. Yeah, so one thought would be I don't think I don't know how long a meeting it'll be, but you know, one thought would be to do it before finance on Monday. That push it pushes us a little bit on some of the uh, licensing stuff, but I don't expect a huge amount of that at this time of year. So wait on the tenth? Yeah, on the tenth. What about the fifth? Is that too soon? That would be, yes. Okay. Because that's that would be immediately after the oh, meeting sorry. and we wouldn't have the time to get the license and stuff okay. okay so i mean i could do earlier on the 12th if if the goal is to have quorum that's the that's the monday right no, no the 12th, no, the 12th would be the the regular i could do it earlier that day just yeah. because bookworm has like a ton of evening programming in the month of october for happily haunted so like during the day actually for October, I can, I'm a bit more flexible. I don't have, I'm going to Michigan. I don't have to be there until like four o'clock. So that means probably leaving here at 10 30. So oh, I could do it. Like really, really, yeah. yeah. Traverse City. Do it at 8 30 in the morning or something. Traverse City? No, Grand Rapids. I got meetings. Or the 10th. Uh... I've broken a few laws here and there. I know what laws are. I can speak for the attorneys. <laughs> <laughs> I've broken a few, just a few. <laughs> the licensing stuff, if you do it without me, you, you will probably have Lieutenant Adams here. And I'll just, if he screws up, I'll yell at him at our family reunion. <laughs> 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 but it's just more, it's more the concern. What Originally, I wasn't even gonna ask because we have, and we would have clerk staff here potentially too. But because we now realize that's the budget meeting, and I and I'm the yeah, I could I could do it on the 11th. Um, you Dean and I would both be up. Dean and you, because we're both on public works. Oh, oh, okay. and you. That's at 5:30. Well, but yeah, we'd have it earlier on, and we could come out from this one and go to that one then. What do, what do we get it done in an hour? Depends on what how much you load on. I mean, usually you do. But we could also hold budget. it if, if you wanted to, it could be held at Public Works. Yeah, could we do that? Just back to back them? Just have to ask. We'll have to make sure that they give us the available space, but on the 10th, on the 11th, oh, on the 11th, yeah. And tell them we usually have like snacks and stuff. So of course. Have to get... Absolutely. I'm just saying. <laughs> I don't go to DPW meetings, so I don't know how long they take. And seeing it's budget time. But their meeting for budget will be long. Yeah, you, their you meeting will be go long. We will go first. We go first. We, we could still do the four the normal four fifteen time. Mm -hmm. 
And in fact, my main concern for you guys, if you do 415 at, at Public Works, we might be done by 445, and you still have 45 minutes to wait around okay. at DPW. But you know that's up to you. I mean, then we'll definitely bring students. Yeah, there you go. And that would be on the 11th. 11th, yeah. I take that. And Gene, he can make. He already makes this meeting, so. Fine with me. It works okay. for me too. Okay. I can make it work. All right, let's plan on the 11th then. So you'll work it out with CPW about space and all that. Okay. Yeah, we'll work that out. Still at four fifty. We'll, we'll tell them if they want us to look at their contracts. Oh no! <laughs> okay, that works. Is that budget for everybody? But we okay. Yeah. Does yeah yeah yeah. Oh, then I'll be there. And do we need to okay that with the group? No, I mean, we'll just, you, it's not something you vote on. It's it's always on the agenda just to talk about in case there needs to be a change. So we'll we'll take care of it. It'll get on the agenda. And, and it'll be at DPW rather than? Most likely. Here. Okay, I'm in. Great. <laughs> I'm in. Okay. All right. I need a motion to adjourn. Uh, Motion to adjourn. Second. Move. Okay. Um, all in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed nay. Chair votes aye. And we are out of here. Thank you. <laughs> the technical term heavy.